Hello and welcome to video number eight and we're going to talk about setting up your membership site. Now as I talked about in the previous video we have two different scripts. We have a member pro which is a little bit more complex and what I recommend that you do honestly is just to use their customer service and pay them the $80 to get it set up and then if you want to learn how to use it it's actually not super hard to do once it is set up but I will say like I said their customer service is one of the best so if you want them to tweak it however you wish they will actually go in and do it and you can go to places like upwork.com that is upwork.com and you can actually find programmers who are experienced in a member pro because it has been out for well over a decade all right and then I'm going to show you how to set up the actual WordPress plugin which is the ultimate membership pro so that's what this video and the next video is going to be about it's going to be a thorough process about walking you through showing you what to set up and how to go about doing that so before i go ahead and show you how to set up the ultimate membership pro what i want to do is log into my a member pro account and kind of show you around so as you can see here the nice thing about this is this is the membership site owner's dream and literally you can go in and you can see there are other plugins here that you can add on to a member pro which allows you to do things like you know sell credits for example you can have a marketplace where you have many different products and somebody could literally come in and buy a bunch of credits and then they can use those credits to actually pick and choose what they want so that's a nice feature to have so pretty much everything that you can think of even if something if you want to sell something that might seem kind of very different and would require some sort of highly technical aspect I'm pretty sure a member pro would probably have it or if it doesn't you can always contact their support now I wanted to show you this but you can actually see that I have used a member pro about for nine years and since then I have contacted their support and every single time I've contacted their support, they have just been phenomenal. They've really been there to help me out. So even as somebody who is technical, sometimes we run into situations where we just can't resolve the issue. So I found that personally, a member pro, a lot of times the response you will get is directly from the, the actual creator himself. And if not, you will get very highly trained programmers. And that's really what I like about a member pro. So you really can't get lost. You, you can find people who know what they're talking about. You're not going to run into customer support people that don't really know what they're talking about. So that's the reason why I like a member pro. It's very powerful, but very, very great customer support. So now let's talk about the ultimate membership pro WordPress plugin. So after you go ahead and pay for it, which is 28 bucks, um, as of now, it looks like there's a discount. Sometimes there are going to be a discount. And even if it was $50 and it went the price raised, in my opinion, I feel like the amount of features that they're constantly adding to it is going to be very, very great for you. So what you need to do is simply click download, click download all files and documentation so it does come with documentation which is great so if you have any questions or run into any problems and things that i may not cover on this video there is detailed documentation on there and then of course you can contact the seller themselves they offer support as well all right so the next thing i want to talk about is installing wordpress so in order to install wordpress obviously you'll need to either do it yourself or get somebody else to do it for you. So I'm going to show you a quick and easy way to install WordPress. All right. So when you log into your web hosting panel and most of you and the majority of you will have what we call C panel. And if you scroll down all the way to the bottom, typically you will either find Fantastico or you will find a 
a newer software application called Softaculus. So I would say the majority of you will still see Softaculus and some of you will see the happy smiley face called Fantastico. Either way, all they are is they are basically software applications built in to cPanel which allow you to install WordPress with less than three clicks of the button. All right, so I'm going to go through the process of using Fantastigo here. So we're going to go to WordPress. We're going to click on new installation. And then, of course, we'll install it in a directory. Now, in this case, for you, most of you, you will be installing it on the domain itself. So you'll simply leave this blank. You'll enter the username and password that you want. You'll enter the site name and the description, and then you click on install WordPress. So I'm going to go ahead and do that right now, and I'll see you on the other side. Okay, so after I have installed WordPress, literally all you have to do is go to yourdomain.com slash wp-admin. So yourdomain.com slash wp-admin, or if you're like me and you install WordPress in a subfolder, it's going to be yourdomain.com slash the subfolder name slash wp-admin. All right, so now that you have done that, we have logged into the administrative panel, as we can see here. And now all we need to do is simply install the WordPress plugin. So I'm going to go ahead and locate the file that I went ahead and downloaded. And next, I am going to go ahead and unzip this. And next, as you can see here, there is a main files folder. So we're going to go into it. And then, of course, you see there is a documentation folder. If you click on the index.html file and you open that up in something like Chrome or your other Internet browser, this basically allows you to, to get item support. If you ever run into problems, you can contact your support help desk and you also have access to their knowledge base. Now, as you can see here, it's, it's pretty simple, straightforward installation process. It tells you that the indeed-membership-pro.zip file is the WordPress plugin itself. So I'm going to show you how to install that in just a minute. Really, really easy. So if we go back over here, this is the plugin here. So now all I need to do is simply go over here. We're going to go back to the WordPress site right here. And I am going to go under plugins. So I'm going to go under install plugins. We're going to click on add new. We're going to click on upload, choose file. We're going to locate the file, as you can see here, click open, click install now. And sometimes that can take a few seconds, depending on your internet connection and upload speed. And we click on activate plugin. And there we go. Now this says this is a trial version of ultimate membership pro. So what we need to do now is we need to add our purchase code. So if we click that here, we're going to see purchase code. And they say in order to get your purchase code, basically the way Envato and Code Cannon works is you go back to where you downloaded the file, you click on download, and then of course you click license certificate and purchase code. So I'm going to go ahead and download that. I'm going to get the purchase code and add that over here. All right, I'll do it right now. Okay, great. So now, as you can see here, it says you're activated the ultimate membership pro plugin so we are good to go great awesome so so now we are good to go now in order for you to see better i'm going to collapse the menu so that we can push everything to the left so up at the top you can see the dashboard so this allows you to see how many users you have how many transactions you have how many total amount of transactions you have so basically you're having access to the statistics every time you log in. Now up at the top, we have ultimate affiliates. We have the ability to create levels. So I'm just going to give you a quick run through here. So as you can see, you have different levels. You have free levels, you have paid levels, you have recurring levels. And by default, 
the membership program is actually going to install a few for you. So you can actually see what a free level looks like, what a one-time plan looks like, what a recurring plan looks like. So you can obviously delete these if you don't want them, but they're there so that they can kind of give you a guideline there. And I'm going to give you a deeper run through later on, but for now, I just want to give you a quick overview of everything that is inside this particular membership plugin. And then we'll talk about, you know, set a process and all that in the last video. So next we have payment services and you have the ability to integrate with PayPal, authorized.net, Stripe to checkout, bank transfer, Braintree and Payza. Now, the majority of you would probably be integrating with PayPal and Stripe. So Stripe is very much like a credit card processing system, very much like authorized.net or to checkout. Now, it's probably better if you do this or this or to checkout you can do. They actually allow you to accept PayPal and credit cards as well. So in my opinion, I haven't really seen another membership script that integrates into so many services with such a low fee. All right, so the next thing is we have lockers, which basically gives you the ability to lock content. And then you have showcases, which is basically the front end forms. You can create register forms, login forms, and change the style and, and the template design. Subscription plan forms, we have account pages, and member lists. So that's just showing how things look. And then of course you have social logins. So if you want people to have the ability to log in to your membership site via their Facebook social account, their Twitter, Google, LinkedIn, and all these other social services, then all you have to do is simply click on one of them and then integrate into Facebook and that will allow them to do that. Basically, all this does is it makes it more user friendly so that people don't have to remember their username and password. All they have to do is simply log in into their social login. Next, we have the coupons, which allows you to create coupons. And that's pretty self-explanatory. And then you have lock rules. So you can lock specific pages and posts depending on the certain target users. And I'll show you more about that in just a minute. And then of course you have payment history, you have notifications. So you have basically email notifications and you can customize the email templates however you wish. And it specifically tells you, okay, this email is going to the user. This email is going to you as the administrator. And then of course, next we have magic features, which gives you the ability to add additional taxes, opt-in settings, you can integrate with WooCommerce. You can integrate with all these other things like BuddyPress. You have membership cards. Uh, you have invitation codes. There's a lot of really cool features that you can literally add to your membership script. And you have order invoices so that you can provide printable invoices for each order into the account page. So that's great for being compliant with other countries. And then of course, under general options, we have the ability to create default pages. So things like the register page or subscription page or login or logout or user account page. So you have the ability to create these pages or connect them with existing pages. So as you can see, if we click save changes here. And we go over to our pages section. You can see that the script has automatically created so many different pages at your convenience. And that's pretty much it when it comes to a brief overview of what's inside of this system. So as you can see, there's a good amount of options and features and all that good stuff. Uh, but what I'm going to do in the next video is I'm going to walk you through step by step to make sure that you understand how to use everything.